Lewis Hamilton, Daniel Ricciardo admits Canadian Grand Prix Mercedes worry. Max Verstappen topped the Montreal timesheets in FP1 and FP2 and Hamilton was half a second slower than the Dutchman's 1.12.198s best on circuit Gilles Villeneuve. Yet unlike Verstappen, the championship leader didn't use the pink walled hyper soft tires, Pirelli's quickest compound. The silver arrows also appear to have the pace advantage on the long runs, their average lap times seeing Hamilton two tenths of a second quicker than Verstappen despite using a slower tire. And Ricciardo, the winner in Monaco last time out, has noted that Mercedes remain the strongest team in North America. I think Mercedes are going to be quick tomorrow for sure, he told Sky Sports F1 after FP2. It's a they're the ones to beat at the moment. But hopefully we have a smooth date tomorrow and we'll try and get a bit more laps and more pace. Ricciardo has delayed a grid place penalty this weekend, reusing an old MGUK component after that particular part of his car's kinetic energy system failed in Monte Carlo a fortnight ago. But Ricciardo suffered reliability problems believe that restricted him to just 41 laps all day, teammate Verstappen completing 68 by contrast. On the cause of the problem which hampered Ricciardo's FP2, the Australian revealed, not related to MGUK. There was some electrical stuff going on. It hindered us this morning and this afternoon. Not the best day but we're okay. Obviously Max showed good pace so I think there is a bit for us to learn. Verstappen said, it was a good day. The car is working well but we are still lacking a bit of top speed. You could see that in the long runs. I think especially Mercedes look very quick there. But I think we are not too far away. Just, in general, a positive day. The 2018 Canadian Grand Prix continues with FP3, 4 p.m., and qualifying, 7 p.m., later today.